All right, Cats Ninjas, Sensei Lance here today, and what we're going to be doing is we're going to be working with one of our modern day weapons. We are going to be working with the short stick. Now, before we get started with the weapons at all, one of the things that I like to, to, to seriously express right now, make sure that whenever you're training weapons and you're taking your training to that level to train very responsibly, take it very seriously because if you're out here playing around, that's when somebody could get hurt. Okay, so whenever you're training with the weapons, make sure that uh, you either train with a responsible adult or if you're training with another young person, make sure there's a responsible adult around that, that can kind of help out and, and monitor what you're doing and make sure everything is, is done responsibly and properly. Okay, now with that being said, what we're going to do is we are going to get into our defensive posture. From here, uh, the stick is in my right hand, so therefore my right foot is going to be in front, and I'm going to have my left hand right here. In front of my chest is kind of a guarding sense in case in case uh, the person that's attacking me, their punches get past my, my, uh, my stick or something. From here, I can use my hands to defend. Okay, so from here, the stick's in front. What I'm going to do, first, I'm going to chamber it. I bring it to the shoulder, okay? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to come down in a downward angle. I'm going to use my hips. I'm going to turn my hips, and I'm going to come in a downward fashion, at a downward angle here. Boom. Now, as the stick comes down, what I'm going to do when I get down here, I'm going to rotate my pinky to the sky. And then what I'm going to do is I am going to bring it up and I'm going to come down again, slashing. It's like I'm drawing a giant X in the air. I'm going to do it just a little faster this time. From here, down and down. And I get a lot of momentum in that when I do it. Okay, so from here, hands in front, I'm going to come down and down and then back. All right? Now make sure I chamber at the shoulder. That's where I'm going to get my power from here. It's a total body activity, just like we've talked about in the past. It's like when you hit a baseball with a bat. You don't hit, you don't, you don't do this. You don't just use your hands. You use your whole body. It's the same thing with the weapon. So it's here, my hands in front. I'm going to come down and down, and then back to the front. Down and down, and back to the front. Down and down, and back to the front. Chamber, down and down, and back to the front. Chamber. Down and down, back to the front. All right, Caps Ninjas, we're back here. I got Sensei Alex with me today. And what we are going to be doing is we are going to be working on the figure eight, the down and down with a partner. Now, always remember that whenever you do this, um, if you're going to be working with someone, work with a responsible adult. We always want to work as responsibly as we can because when you start dealing with the weapons, this is when things can get really dangerous. And if it's not treated responsibly, people can get hurt. Okay, so make sure that uh, either you train with a responsible adult or if you're training with another young person, that a responsible adult is around. Okay, now from here, what we're going to do is we're going to work the down down. This is just a little partner drill you can do to help develop uh, uh, the impact skills, getting used to the, the stick actually clacking into something without tearing up something uh, nice or important. Uh, and also, it also develops reflexes because you're trying to keep up with each other. Okay, works on your reflexes, works on your hand-eye coordination. And there's a lot of trainers out there that swear by uh, uh, the stick training because uh, of the reflexes that you'll develop from using it. Okay, so from here we are. What we're going to do is we're going to face off with each other. Both of us got our right foot in front. Both of us got the, the scrimmage stick in our right hand. We got our hand right here. It's kind of a guarding stance. We start at the shoulder. What we're going to do is we're going to down and down. And down back to the shoulder. Down, down. Back to the shoulder. Down, down, back to the shoulder. And notice how we start off slow at first. We don't want to start off fast. Okay? Always remember, slow and correct is better than fast and wrong. Okay? So we always start off slow, just one, to make sure that we, we understand what we're doing, and two, to make sure we're in the same rhythm. Because if one of us is off on a different rhythm, well, that's when somebody gets accidentally whacked with the stick and, and can get hurt. Okay, so here we go. What we're going to do is we're going to speed up just a little bit here. Here. All right. And that is the Caps Short Stick Combo Number 1. Make sure to practice this. You can practice this like we discussed before in the air by yourself. Okay. Or you can practice with a partner. Have fun with that at home. 